So today I've got a tool for you guys and it's um, going to be some home decor things and a bit of fashion and just like random stuff, just kind of miscellaneous things. Last time I'd done like a homeware haul, a lot of people uh, liked it and I've been asked to do one like since then so I thought I'd throw in some homey bits. So the first thing I really really love, I love the kind of shabby chic interior design. Um, look, so I love these. These drawers are from Dolly Bobo, like the store online. Um, they're quite smallish, and yeah, so you can see like the detail on it. I think they they weren't actually too expensive because some shabby chic things are really overpriced. I'll put the link down below if you want to check out the Dolly Bobo store. Okay, then I was in Ikea and I picked up just a few bits and bobs. I got some f just like plain frames for my hallway to put like a few, um, you know, pictures up. And I got cushions, but I thought it might be a bit boring to just show you like multicolored cushions. I think you've seen some of them anyway, like in my background. I got this one, this mirror, and I don't know how I can show you this properly, but it's just small, it's really cute. It's just quite plain, but I just like the design. And yeah, that was quite inexpensive as well. I also received this, um, what's it, Reed Diffuser recently. It's from Next, and I think it's so cute looking. Um, so close up it looks like that. The scent is Milan. It's not the usual scent I go for, it's kind of, it's fresh. I don't know how to explain it, but um, go and sniff it anyway if you're in Next, Next. It gives a really nice subtle scent to the house, it's not overpowering. I've got the uh, like perfume of the New York scent as well, which I wrote about on my blog if you wanna check that out. But um, yeah, I thought I'd include that. I also really like the Urban Outfits homeware stuff and it's not often I get stuff from there because I, I think I like it when they have sales on. So I, th I think these were in a sale. I got some of these. Um, they're just like jars, like colored jars. They do them in all different colors. I put candles in there. So I just put li like little tea candles in the bottom. As you can see, there's like loads of wax in there. But they were like five pounds each. So not too bad. And they look really, you've probably seen them in my back background before. Um, but yeah, they just, they're quite cute for home decor and like at night time. They remind me of like Moroccan kind of tea, like lamps. <laughs> I don't know if that's right or not, but because they're red, I think. And I got one in blue, but I didn't like the colour as much when there's a candle in it. So then I decided to use it for my brushes. So this is from Urban Outfit. It's just a little candle jar and I use it for my brushes at the moment, which might change, but I think they look quite cute. Yeah. I also wanted to show something really, really pretty I got from Zara Home, and I, I love their homeware stuff, and this was like a little kind of splurge, but it would look so, so nice in the flat, and something that I could keep for like years. This kind of Moroccan style, I don't even know what it's called, it's like a lamp, kind of, um, but also I'm gonna keep it on the floor. It has a sturdy ring, <laughs> and up close, it looks like that. So pretty, it's like a brushed gold, like um, kind of bronzy, coppery gold. Um, but that's so pretty and then it has a door and then uh, you can like keep candles in there so I'm gonna put candles in there and that was about 39.99 so that was like one of the most expensive things in this haul but um, I just think it's really really gorgeous and then to go in there I needed well I wanted to get kind of a, a big candle so I got this one from Zara home again at the same time and this was a f quite an expensive 15.99 but it's really really big and it's gorgeous so it's just this white candle and it has this um, etching um, design on it. I don't know if you can see that. Um, and it's just so pretty. That is gonna go in there and make my day. <laughs> a little thing was actually given to me. My mum gave this to me. It's just a little, really small thing, like home decor. And it's this little heart. It's so cute. It's like um, appliqued beads and sequins. And it's just really cute. Um, she said it was from Paper Chase, so they should still do it. The back of it's silver, and <laughs> I just thought I'd include it because it's just really cute. And I really like how quite, it looks quite handmade. The next thing is bloody massive to show you. I can't show you it, but I got a throw for a sofa in the front room because it was the sofa on its own was just, it just looked boring. So I wanted to add some like coziness to the to the place and like it, I don't know. I like the texture of it, so I got this throw. I don't know how well you can see this but it's kind of bobbly. Um, they still do this in Ikea, um, so you can find it. This would look really nice on the end of your bed or like on a sofa or a chair or something and it just is so like snuggly when it's really cold outside. The tag said it was 16 pounds and then I got to the till and it was about 20 pounds. So I was like, damn you. That's kind of it for the homeware stuff. <laughs> my bracelet got attached to my boob. So I'm gonna move on to kind of a few fashion bits that I got, um, but before I do that, cause I don't have really any beauty stuff to show you but I've got one like beauty related thing so I'll just do that now it's not something that I bought 
but it's something that I received recently and I thought I'd just like mention it to you guys because I know some people might be interested and it is like a, a Christmas like winter inspired thing it's bloody massive so basically if you like samples so if you like glossy boxes and that well it's different to that but okay I'm really bad at explaining things it's this massive box basically whoa and it's basically an advent calendar so I don't know if you can see that but like the chocolate calendars, it's got a little door for each day of December and then um, each day you open one of the doors and you get a sample of like a beauty product. So if I saw this I'd want to know what kind of like samples you'd be getting. So I'll just read out like some examples of some of the brands that you can get in here, like samples of, of the things. So Benefit, which I was quite excited about, um, Yves L'Homme, L'Occitane, L'Occitane, <laughs> Steam Cream, um, Philosophy, uh, la, 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 la. I don't know. Anyway, but these are kind of some of them or all of them, so you can like freeze that and have a look if you want. But anyway, yeah, I think the box is about fifty nine pounds, sixty pounds, which I know is expensive, but I just thought if some of you are interested, um, and it's worth like two hundred pounds, so you know it's pretty cool. So if you want to get this like before December begins, um, I'll put the link down below so you can check it out. Um, yeah. <laughs> now onto fashion bits which I'm really excited about because I've got some things that I really really like at the moment like well obviously that's why I bought them <laughs> I've got this okay you guys know my obsession with faux fur collars faux fur everything and I've wanted a black one for ages and I just went on eBay and actually I was talking to one day from one day's world so I'll link her channel down below if you don't know if you like want to check her out um, and she had a faux black faux fur collar on and she was like she got it from eBay so I was like I'm going on eBay and I found this one and it's just perfect like when it came at first I thought it was a bit small but it's it's really perfectly sized mm, I can't remember how much it was now it wasn't anywhere a lot more or less than about a tenner um I can't remember but I'll try and put the link down below so you can check it out um I love it I just I love that it didn't break the bank and it's really nice and it goes with everything Recently I've got a lot more into shopping on ASOS. I've always kind of liked ASOS, but I've just gone like, it's really addictive. I really want some kind of grey t-shirts, because I feel like they're a really staple piece, and you can wear them with white or black or colour. So I got this really oversized one. If you get this, it's really, really big. I got it in a size 10, and it's massive. Um, but it just looks like this. And it's like a slouchy boyfriend, like, oversized t-shirt. I'll try and link it down below so you guys can find it if you want. And again, it wasn't too much money. It was about a tenner. Um, so, yeah, I'm really happy with that. And then I also got, when I got that top, some jeans. I really wanted some kind of ripped ones because I love that look. That kind of, don't know, like, <laughs> tramp look. <laughs> That's not good. So, they're just kind of um, a black jean. Like, what's that? Uh, what's that called? It's kind of like washed, just, no, I don't know. And at the knees there's like cutouts, so I really like those. And I want to like make more cutouts in the jeans, so I might be doing that. And at the bottom I'd turn them up because they're quite long, they're quite big for me. Um, these were about £30, which is quite good for jeans, so yeah, I quite like them. And while I was on ASOS, I was on just like the main page or something, and there was a picture, you've probably seen it, like there's a picture of a girl with a bright pink beanie on. I'm obsessed with beanies, so I was like, da! So I got it. It's this gorgeous like neon pink beanie. I think they've also got like another colour in this, but up close it looks like that. And it's like a mixed... It's like white and pink, it's so cute, I love it. I wore it like, I don't know, I just really like to wear it and it's it's quite big and stretchy as well, so if you have big hair, like, it's quite suitable. <laughs> and I think that was about 10 pounds as well. And then I was just looking around like a lo local charity shop. I got this top in the charity shop for four pounds, which I think is still a lot for a charity shop, but um, I, I really like it. On me, it fits like slouchy and oversized. And I think it's originally like a size 14 or 16, but yeah, I love a, a good like charity shop find. And then as you know, I like beanies um, and I like getting ones from eBay because they're really inexpensive, like two, three pounds. And they do like loads of colours and I got a khaki slash olive um, coloured beanie. So I'll link it down below if I can. And then the last thing, I went to Topshop and I got this jumper and they do them in different colours if you were, if you like it. And again it's grey and kind of grainy but it's this really, um, how do you say it, it's kind of a meshy light um, knitted jumper. And so it's got like a high kind of roll neck, I can't remember what they're called. Obviously long sleeves, up close the material looks like that. 
it's really nice. Um, the only thing is it's like a little bit itchy, so I've got to get used to that, but yeah, it was um, now £15, so I picked it up, and I got it in size 10. So yeah, that's my kind of really random haul. I hope you liked it, and because I thought I haven't done a haul for a little while, so I'll like mix it up. Also, thank you so much to everyone who, in my last video, gave me like, you know, your opinions and suggestions and stuff like that. Um, it always helps. I'll write like everything I'm wearing in the down bar in case you're wondering. And yeah, I'll see you in my next video. Thank you for watching. Bye!